What's going on guys, it's your boy Jesse D123 back with another video and today we're going to be bringing you guys a new series to the channel. Basically this series is going to consist of me going over new cars to SES drops and asking four very important questions. Showing you guys a new card, giving you guys the pros and cons. How do you guys get this card? Are there any great alternatives? And finally, is this card worth it? And there's no other better card to start the series off with than this 99 signature series chipper jones that's very very anticipated everybody wants this card now drop a like if you guys are excited i'm hoping to keep this video under five minutes because this series is just going to be a quick informative informative and very detailed and gives you guys my opinion and everything that you guys need to know so without further ado let's get right into the video so let's take a look at this signature series chipper jones now off the bat the thing that stands out to mo the most to me is that contact 116 contact against both sides 105 power against righties that's nice which that was a little more though 93 power against lefties that's cool um 102 vision now if vision mattered in this game that would be good but vision doesn't really matter it's all about contact in this game so that's that's it is what it is 125 discipline that's cool and that's pretty much all that stands out on the hitting side now let's take a look at the defensive side so we got 76 fielding that's terrible 74 arm oh my goodness 74 reaction bro He's horrendous on the defensive side. SDS kind of snubbed this card, bro. I'm going to be real with you guys. I'm going to be real with you guys. He kind of snubbed this card. So the next question is, how do you guys get this card? So you guys know SDS put it behind this wall. The Battle Royale, 12-0. You guys have to go 12-0 to get a chance to get this card, man. And it's crazy because 12-0 is kind of impossible. It's doable, but you just got to get lucky. And majority of us cannot do that. Let's be real. Now, since it's a Battle Royale reward, you guys see the price right now. Sal knows at a million snubs. And let's take a look. There's 315 uh, sell orders for a million stubs, bro. Like, that's crazy. 350 people want to buy this card for a million stubs. It's probably going to go up by the time you guys watch this video. But that's crazy. Now, obviously, you guys are probably asking. There has to be some good alternatives. And yes, I got you guys. I got you guys. So the very first great alternative to that card it's going to be this new player of the month 99 overall jose ramirez now i'm gonna throw the signature series chipper stats on screen probably um over the hitting and defense um logos right there so you guys can pick can compare but i'm just going to be going over the ones that stand out the most um first of all this card's free not a million stubs he's free just get the program done and you guys get this card some notable stats right off the bat is jose ramirez has maxed out contact against lefties chipper jones only has 116. Um, he has maxed out power against lefties. Chipper only has 93. Power against righties, 103 Jose Ramirez. Power against righties, Chipper Jones, 105. So it's pretty much the same. Um, 96 vision, that doesn't really matter, like I said. So now let's go to the defensive stats. 84 fielding, Chipper only has 76. Jose Ramirez beats him in there. 80 arm, Chipper Jones has 74 arm. Um, Jose Ramirez beats him in there. 87 reaction, Chipper only has 74 reaction. You guys see what I'm saying? This card is free, bro stress free the other one is high stress <laughs> i i personally think he's one of the best great alternatives to this 99 signature chipper jones that's just my opinion you guys may disagree or agree so next up as a great alternative will be this 97 overall anthony rendon um well compared to that chipper jones um the contact against lefties and righties is a little less than chipper jones but it's damn near close um and i think overall he can compete with them 92 power against righties chipper has 105 power against righties 106 power against lefties chipper has 93 now they kind of flip flop there if you guys get me um obviously rendon is a right-handed hitter chipper is a switch so he has the advantage there and rendon can only play one position that chipper can play what is it i think left field only so he does have some alternatives um now let's take a look at the defensive stats 78 fielding versus chipper 76 rendon beats him there 62 arm versus 74 arm and chipper cheap chipper beats him there 86 reaction versus chippers 74 reaction rendon beats him there so again this card is free and he competes very well with that 12 and 0 battle royale um <laughs> reward chipper jones a million stubs chipper jones versus this free card you guys get what i'm trying to say an honorable mention would be the 96 prestige version of this chipper jones obviously that signature series is going to be better than him because it's supposed to be but the contact, excuse me, the power against lefties is more on this card versus the signature series. He only has 93 power against lefties on the signature series versus 117 to this one. Now, that's pretty much the only thing better about this card versus the signature series. So that's just why he's an honorable mention. But he can play shortstop as well. Obviously, the signature series can only play left field. So if you guys like that, is there it is. And the last alternative to Chipper Jones is going to be this 99 overall player of the month 
Nicholas Castellanos. Now, when it comes to the hitting stats, Nick blows Chipper Jones out of the water, bro. Maxed out contact against lefties while Chipper Jones only has 116. 110 power against righties while Chipper Jones only has 105. 118 power against lefties while Chipper Jones only has 93. You guys get what I'm saying. It's kind of night and day. The only stat he beats him in is the contact versus righties. And obviously, Chipper Jones beats him because he's a switch hitter. Because Nicholas Castellanos is only a right-handed hitter. So, it is what it is there. But overall, obviously, Nick Nicholas has the better hitting stats. Now, let's go to defense. 80 fielding. But you got to remember, Nicholas Castellanos, this is his secondary position. So, I believe it goes down by 5 points. And if it does, he's at 75 fielding at third base. Chipper Jones has 76. So, he beats him in that category. 75 arm. Chipper Jones has 74 arm. So, Nicholas beats him in that category. But they're pretty much the same. 80 reaction, Chipper Jones has 74 reactions. So Nicholas beats him in that category. And this is why I think he's a great alternative because his hitting stats are insane. And once again, this card is free, guys. This card is free versus the 12-0 stress, stressful Chipper Jones. And he's a million stubs as well, man. So it's overall just night and day with that card. I think all these alternatives that I gave you guys are very, very good. Now, I'm pretty sure I missed some of the alternatives. So comment down below which cards I missed, any cards that stand out to you guys that I missed that I should have mentioned because it's very important and I, and I want to get better at that. So comment down below any great alternatives you guys think I missed. And the final question, is this card worth it? Personally, I do not think this card is worth it because the stress you got to go through to get this card is insane. Let alone a million stubs for this card and all the other alternatives, alternatives I gave you guys are free. Yeah. I think the alternatives are better. Personally, that Jose Ramirez, I think he is the best third baseman in the game. Not to mention, all his stats that you, that you guys seen, they go up by three once you prestige him. So, he just gets that much better. It's insane, bro. Um, they kind of snubbed this Chipper Jones card. They could have made him a lot better, but they didn't. They watered him down. But it is what it is, man. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video, man. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the new series, man. Drop comments on improvements that I can make. Um, did I miss any cards? Any other good alternatives? Let me know down in the comments, man, because this series I want to keep on the channel. Obviously, this is the first of many. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this little man. Hopefully, it was very informative and gave you guys a decision. Do you guys want to actually grind for this Chipper Jones? Probably not, especially if you guys already have that Jose Ramirez. But yeah, guys, so that's going to be it for the video. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. Drop a like if you guys did. It's been your boy, Jesse D123, and I'm out.